next tonight, the throughway authority now weighing a toll hike that, if approved, could bump rates by 10% over the next four years. So how much of a toll could these changes take on your wallet? Well, we've done the math for you here tonight. The first 5% increase would kick in January 1st of 2024. Another 5% hike would follow at the start of 2027. While this will create higher rates across the board, it could pay now to have an easy pass in your car. After the hikes, drivers paying their tolls by mail will be shelling out 75% more for their trips. Taking this to street level, a trip from downtown Buffalo to downtown Albany will run easy pass holders roughly $12.45. In 2024, a 5% boost makes that $13.07. Another 5% increase makes it $13.72. This all adds up to a few dollar increase for a round trip, but why bump the rates at all? 7 News anchor reporter Taylor Epps going in depth for us tonight to find out what's driving these rate hike proposals and the impact it can have on you. So what does this proposal mean for you? While there's no need to panic just yet, the current toll rates are locked right where they are for all of 2023. These changes wouldn't take place until 2024. Any increase in tolls, we're, we're going to feel it here for sure. This proposal is just the first step of a long process, but if approved, the Thruway Authority would raise the rate of tolls by 10% by 2027 for Easy Pass users. I, I, I'm almost speechless. I mean, every time we turn around, something's going up. And ultimately, you know, it's going to get passed on to the consumer. Brian Kim and suite of trucks travel up and down the thruway, carrying freight to Syracuse and Rochester for Buffalo Transport Company Incorporated. And lately, it's been costly. You know, it's actually my 47th year in the business. I've, I've never seen anything like it. Cost of fuel, the cost of labor, and it's just like piling on. His trucks use Easy Pass, but this change would cost you even more if you don't have one. Right now, you pay 30% more without an Easy Pass. With this proposal, you'd pay 70 5% more in 2024. Either way, you'd have to pay at least $2 more a trip from Buffalo to Albany. I mean, you know, on the surface, you know, what's two bucks? But that adds up very, very quickly. But how do we compare to our neighbors in other states? According to the Thruway Authority, our toll rates are the lowest in the country. The national average is about 17 cents per mile. Our rate on the Thruway is 5 cents per mile, while Ohio's is 6 cents, 11 cents in New Jersey, and about 14 in Pennsylvania. We don't want to see anything go up, but I'm sure there's good reasons why the New York State Thruway Authority is doing what they're doing. So what is the reason? When I asked, the Thruway Authority sent over this statement saying, quote, we receive no state, federal, or local tax dollars to support our operations. We will not have had a system-wide toll increase for Easy Pass customers in 14 years. This is a responsible financial plan to ensure the authority will meet its growing capital and infrastructure needs. So next, the Thruway Authority Board of Directors are going to vote whether or not they want to move forward with these proposals. Then there will be some public hearings, and I'm told a final decision wouldn't be made till the end of next year. Taylor Epps, 7 News.